Hello, it's Tom from Tom Chubich Dean today. We will be reviewing uh, the Samsung Galaxy Tab S6 Lite. Hmm, we switched to tablets again. So I got this for Christmas. And uh, yeah, it's a great tablet. Now, um, this is a been reviewing God knows how many. Is it a month? Two months? I don't know, I'll have to check. But, well, of the time of recording this video, anyway, so today we'll be reviewing this. And we have a lot more to cover. So, let's just get started reviewing it, shall we? So, here we are with the Galaxy Tab S6 Lite, and uh, build quality is actually pretty good. I don't know what metal this is, but I think it's aluminium of some sort. It feels good. It feels premium, even though it's a £350 tablet. So, yeah, it's really good. So let's do what we usually do. Let's do the sides. So starting off with the top of this tablet, we have a headphone jack. We have a microphone and we have speakers here. So that's the top. On the left, we have absolutely nothing. <laughs> Just literally absolutely nothing. And then on the right, we have a lot of things, actually. So the S Pen, which I'm going to take off to show you later. So on this side, we have the main things like the power button we have. We have... The volume keys. I think that's another microphone. And then the S and then the um I think that's the micro SD card slot. Yeah it is. The micro SD card slot. <laughs> and then on the bottom we have speakers, a USB C port, which is always a good thing to see, and then nothing else. So and then the back, which we have a single camera, which I think is 12 megapixel. So the camera is 12 megapixel, I think. And then uh, the Samsung logo, it's all brightness colours. And the sound is by AKG, which is what Samsung have partnered up with the sound company. And then on the front, it has a black barrier, so I'm not sure you'll be able to see, but it has like a camera at the top there. And that's pretty much the only interesting part. So, whatever orientation you have it is fine. Like this way or that way. Perfectly fine. Now, this is the tablet, so let's turn it on, shall we? Which, there we go. Oop, turn it on. So, here we go. Let me just put it into vertical. Oop. It just has this quite nice splash screen. Let me just bring it closer. Okay, so swipe up to unlock like usual. We have. Right, so here we go. So here it is, the beautiful tablet. Right here. I quite like it. So this is a TFT uh, panel display. And it's really, really good. So here we have all the basic app functions and the thin black border I like. So the gestures, it's you can have a navigation bar. Those are the main navigation bar. The burger lines, the circle lines and the arrow there. So the good thing about this tablet is, do you know, do you realise that messaging icon there? Well, that can access your phone if you link it to your phone. So, yeah. And then you can send messages through this to whoever you want to send the messages to through the mobile phone, even though it's through this tablet. So, the main thing about this tablet is the S Pen, which is really, really nice if you're into drawing and or just want to use a stylus, because it's... An incredibly nice stylus. Just look at it though. It's I'm not sure if you'll be able to see this, but it has a rubber nib. It 
well, it has the rubber nib on top, and then just there. It's about the size of a pencil, but not the weight of one. It's very light, so anybody can hold it. And uh, this button here can bring up a load of lists which you can customise. You see, so let's just test it, shall we? So it can be in one or two orientations. So I'm just going to put it in this for now. Brilliant. And then I'm just going to press this button once. Oh. Oh, God. Yeah, and it'll bring up this, which you can edit to be however you like. Add custom applications, which I have added. I have added Autodesk and Artflow, which are all very cool. cool. So, another thing about this S Pen. So, if your tablet is, well, gone to sleep, you can press and hold this stylus. Then just press your tablet once. And it'll bring up an instant note. So a quick note. So just write quick note. Beautiful. So that's how you do that, and you can change all the colours in here as well. So for example, if you want to do like, for example, in vertical mode, a shopping list, you can very easily do that like one things to milk you can do that for example so and then you can just rub it out that i find that real cool and then just to go there just press the home button it'll fetch you here which then you can open again so that's really cool so if i i think you can just have a note just pop up there so let me try it if I just hold down the S Pen button and tap it twice, it'll bring it up instantly. And you can be like, um, Hi there, viewers. Hi there. So, and then you can just press that. And then it should say, uh, How do you close this? So I've actually been doing my things on here. So, there we go. And there we go. That's pretty much what the S Pen does. So, if you flick up, there's the app drawer. It's just the basic apps I've got at the minute. So, basic apps. Go on. So, like, one of some of my favourite games, Minecraft and some others. And then, yeah. So gaming on this tablet is not bad whatsoever, but it still has some complications because essentially it's a budget tablet. So this can attach it. So it has to go in a special way. So if you put it in vertical here with the camera at the top, you have to have it facing upwards towards the camera, then put it on the right side. Like that, and it'll automatically, and then it'll be quite a strong magnet, actually. Not as strong as some, but quite strong, no matter what. And you can probably hear that pen sound. Brilliant. So, that's pretty much the Samsung Galaxy Tab S6 Lite. So, if you enjoyed um, this Samsung Galaxy S Tab S6 Lite video, then feel free to subscribe, you can always unsubscribe later or you don't have to subscribe in the first place and I'll, uh, I'll see you all later.